Did you know that weightlifting belts don't directly support your back? Your body has its own inner weight belt that's primary purpose is to stabilize your spine and prevent injury. Bracing your core. Taking a deep breath into your belly and holding it in conjunction with tightening your torso. This creates a lot of internal pressure in your core called intra-abdominal pressure. When you perform daily tasks and lifts properly, your core musculature should be all that you need to support your spine. A weightlifting belt increases the efficiency of your core musculature in order to lift heavier weights. It assists in creating extra intra-abdominal pressure. A weightlifting belt indirectly supports your back by providing feedback to your core to tighten and make itself as rigid as possible. The belt itself doesn't provide support to your back. Your core muscles can tense up more when they've got something to push against. The weightlifting belt provides that pushback. Do's and don'ts of wearing a weight belt. Wear a belt during lifts that cause heavy load on your spine. It can be worn anywhere above your hips but not touching your ribs in a position that is comfortable and allows you to create the necessary pressure against it without compromising your form. Do not use a belt as a band-aid for previous injuries or for lower back pain. Do not put the weight belt around your hips. Do not put the belt on too tight like a corset and do not wear it for your whole workout. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss my next episode on a new health and fitness related topic.